hey everyone okay in this video we will see how to you know hello everyone okay in this video we will see how to register routing gateway based on SIP username and password authentication uh, to do this uh, first of all we have to go to operation management and registration management here we will enter the SIP username password server IP that we have received from our vendor and we'll make an entry let's say I'll make a real entry on my one of the server so I can register this uh, gateway I have simply entered all the basic information that are required to enter. SIP port you can change if there is a need if your vendor or routing gateway has provided you another SIP port then you can simply put that port okay and simply I will apply. Now uh, this option mark whatever name you have entered here okay you need to enter this name in routing gateway so I'm just going to uh, go uh, I'll go to uh, you know routing gateway I'll make entry filter there is no routing gateway I'll just make a name routing auth I'll enter prefix double four and then I'll simple I'll simply go to initial settings and I'll click gateway type here I need to select registration so whatever option was there on mark it has to be same on this uh, on this on this uh, field you need to write same name okay once done just click ok apply and you're done now go back once if you press filter you see uh, the column become uh, you know white which means it's, it's it's working fine to verify you need to go to online routing gateways in account management then uh, gateway operation click open sorry go back online gateways filter you can see the you know the routing gateway is online now so we have uh, successfully configured uh, uh, routing gateway based on SIP authentication using use, uh, username and password